I'm Colleen Madden and I'm playing Georgie, Georgie Burns, in Simon Stevens' um, Heisenberg at Forward Theatre. And uh, I want to tell you a little story about how I met my husband, my husband Jim Ridge. We, I had just come from New York where, you know, my career was opening like a flower. And I came to this podunk little town in Wisconsin called Spring Green and my agent let me do it. And uh, I got off the plane, I thought, oh, it's actually pretty fantastic out here. And um, got to Spring Green, really loved Spring Green. And I met Jim Ridge and um, my, my first thought was, you know, we weren't right for each other at all. I wasn't really looking for a partner, first of all. But um, we got to be friends within the first few weeks of my working there. And one of our first converse, like one of our first, we talked about spirituality and science and politics and uh, God and uh, uh, race and nature and everything. And um, all the things that were important to us and values. But we each said, you know what, I'm not really that into you, so we'll, let's just be friends, is that cool? And we both were totally on board with that. And that is the worst way to try and not start a relationship. Because it meant that everything was okay to say, we weren't always trying to put our best foot forward, we could like show our ugly bits, and um, and pretty soon, I felt like he was like my guy. And um, so that was an uncomfortable situation for me because I really didn't want to be attached. And I was going back to New York. Um, and then came the fateful day where he asked me um, on a date. And he was riding a motorcycle at the time. And we got on his motorcycle and had our helmets on and went through this, these beautiful back roads, Spring Green, Wisconsin, this beautiful summer day. And um, he dropped me off at my apartment and he proceeded to go home, but because it was a beautiful day, he took off his helmet. And he said to himself, I'll just feel like I'm in love and I'll go, you know, 30 miles an hour on the back roads. And a deer hit him. So he fell off his bike, totaled his bike, almost totaled <coughs> his brain. And the next day, I was so worried about him and I had never experienced that kind of worry about for some, you know, for someone else before. So that was it, guys. I was sunk. And I've been with him ever since.